fighting breaks out at Lexington Concord in April. We talked about that, all right? Well, what's significant is fighting spreads to upstate New York. If we look at this map, we can see this is Lake Champlain, okay? And at the southern end of Lake Champlain, there's this large British fort. It's called Fort Ticonderoga. And on May 10th, 1775, a group of American militia led by Ethan Allen, who's from Vermont, Benedict Arnold, we're going to talk about Benedict Arnold later today, sees Fort Ticonderoga because it's loaded with cannons. It's loaded with military equipment. This attack on the fort's not authorized by Congress. Congress is actually just meeting for the first time this day. We're going to pick that up a little bit later. It's authorized by the Massachusetts Committee of Safety and a bunch of angry guys in Vermont. Okay, they're taking the war to the English. Okay, there's no reason this should happen, but it does. And over the next couple of days, and we'll see a map in a minute that expend, extends on this, um, the Americans seize a second fort called Crown Point, which we really don't need to worry about. And Benedict Arnold actually raids Canada, okay? The Americans are taking the war to the Champlain Valley. They're taking the war to the British, okay? 